you realize your friends are feral ghouls, right? They're not feral. They're sick. They can't help what they've become. It's an illness. And it certainly doesn't justify you trying to wipe us out. What do you mean, it's an illness? It's an illness that affects the brain. We're going to find a cure, and we are going to drive you out of our home. We've defended this place for over 200 years. Do you think you're the first outsider I've met that's chosen to brand feral ghouls as monsters? How many of them have you needlessly slaughtered while ignorantly thinking you're doing the world a favor? You've been here for 200 years? Why? We worked here as entertainers until the bombs fell. The radiation may have changed us, but we decided to make this place our home. Over time, the illness took the minds of my friends, and those that we love. I am going to find a cure, and fix my friends before someone like you comes along and exterminates us all. Ghouls like your friends, it's too late for them. The radiation changed them. Forever. So you're admitting my friends are sick, and yet you try to kill them anyway? I'd say that makes you the only monster around here. It's not a sickness. The radiation has consumed their minds. They've become feral. You're wrong. Rachel is going to find a way to cure them. We're going to fix this. My beloved left this place years ago to find a cure to this disease. In return, I swore that I'd keep our people safe by defending our home. When Rachel walks back through those gates with the cure in hand, then you'll see, everyone will see, that I was right. Can we move out before I start... Puking? I promise you, there is no cure. You'd be better off trying to find her, so you can be together. You're wrong. There is a cure. There has to be. But maybe she needs my help. If Rachel is still out there, I'll find her. And we'll search for this cure together. I'll gather what remains of my friends, and we'll leave this place in your care. Don't worry about the radiation. It will no longer be a burden to you and your kind. Here, you should have this. Consider it an apology for misjudging you. <laughs>